So hi everybody and welcome to my channel. So I have some people go ahead and leave some comments and I also have some people go ahead and email me and ask me, hey, time for streaming. Is there a good ad blocker that I could go ahead and use to stop the ads from coming in on third party apps for the Fire Stick? Well, yes, there is. So stay tuned. I'll show you how to get it. We'll open it up. We'll set it up. It's time for streaming. So hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Thanks for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. So if you go ahead and on your Fire Stick, you download third party, let's say movie apps, you know what they are, I'm not gonna mention them because of YouTube guidelines, but you know what they are. And you wanna stop some of them because when you open it up, all of a sudden you start getting an ad on the bottom of the screen or you get a full screen ad and it's just annoying. You gotta either wait for it to stop playing or click on that back button. Well, here I'm gonna show you a great app that you can use and it's going to stop those ads only on your third party apps i'm on the fire stick 4k max second generation if you're looking for another device or a fire stick check out my description down below i have a couple of links on there go ahead and click on it no extra cost to you small commission to the channel and it does help out bring some more videos so let's go ahead and if you don't have the app downloader let's go i'll show you how to get it Go over to the left on the home screen, go down to search. Go ahead over to the letter D, click on the letter D, wait for it to come up and populate, click on downloader. I'm gonna need apps and games, click on downloader again. If you like what you're seeing so far, click on that like and subscribe button and ring that bell. That way you know when I put up some more videos. Download your own it. Go ahead, click on that enter button on your remote. Give that a few seconds to download, install itself. Now let's go ahead, open it up. Go ahead, click on allow, click OK. Now right on the neat where it says enter a URL or a search term, go ahead and type in the following. 21833N0. Then click on go. It's gonna bring you to the time for streaming webpage. Give it a few seconds to come on in and we'll go ahead and continue. Once you're on the time for streaming webpage, go over to the right where the three lines are, click on it, come down to where it says download, click on downloads, give it a few seconds for the page to change. Now what you want to do is go ahead and scroll down to where it says ad blockers. Let's go over to ad guard. This is one of the best ones that I, and I use it and I find it works really great on stopping all those ads on your third party apps. Go ahead and click on Ad Guard and let it go ahead and start to download. Now remember, once it downloads, it's gonna come up to the next page and it's gonna say Install. But right now we come up to here because we just downloaded Downloader. We gotta go ahead, click on Settings, click on Install, and then Downloader, go ahead and turn on. Click on that Back button, click on it again, reopen up Downloader, type back in the web page, Two one eight three three zero, and then click on go. Let it redirect itself again. Another way you can do that so you don't have to do this all over again is go right after you download downloader, go into your settings applications, and then go ahead and give the permission right away. So let's go ahead over to where the three lines are. Click on it. Downloads, click on downloads. Again, we give it a few seconds. Go down to where it says add blockers and let's click on add guard. Now it will download with no issues at all. What it's gonna do now, it's gonna come up and say install, which we wanna do. Go over to the right, click on install. Give it a few seconds. Once you come to this part here, go over and click on done. Don't open it up. What we want to do now is click on delete. Delete again. This is go ahead. So we take off the file out of the downloader app so it doesn't take up room on your Fire Stick. Go ahead now, click on that home button on your remote. Let's go over to the right where the three squares and the plus sign is. We gotta go ahead, open that up. 
go all the way down to the bottom because anytime you install a new app, it always is at the bottom. Go over here on your remote. You just want to highlight it. Click the three line button on your remote and then click on move to front. Click on that home button. Now add guards can be right at the very first line on your fire stick. Click that enter button. Let's open it up so we could go ahead now and set it up. Go ahead and click down on your directional pad. Click over to the left. Click on protection is disabled and let it slide over to green. Go ahead and create local VPN. That's fine. Give it a few seconds and then we want to say OK. Click down, highlight OK, click the enter button. Now what you want to do is go ahead and click on that back button one time. On the top left hand side, the three lines, go ahead and click on it. You want to come down to settings. Click on settings. Come down to DNS filtering. Click on that. Come down one time to highlight. Click on it to turn it on. Come down to the next part here where it says DNS server. Click on it. Now what you want to do is give two clicks on your directional pad down. And you want to go to where it says add guard DNS. Okay, again, you're not really going to see it move or highlight. Just remember two clicks and then click on the enter button and it will put the check mark right in your box. Once you have done this, go ahead and click on that back button. Click the back button again. And again, you want to make sure that it is protection is on. It's in green. Once that's done, go ahead and click on that home button. And you're all set for when you watch your third party apps. No commercials are going to come in anymore. No more ads. I hope you find this video very helpful and entertaining. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about the ad guard for your fire stick. Remember to click on that like and subscribe button and ring that bell. That way you know when I put up some more videos. And remember, day or night, it's time for streaming.